Hello everybody! My name is Sviatoslav and in this video I would like to talk about 5 best exercises for your vision, which is good for everybody. Understanding how the eye muscles work with myopia allows you to choose the right set of exercises. There are many types of eye exercises that are used for myopia and hyperopia. Each type of gymnastics helps to relax or strengthen certain muscle groups. With myopia, exercises are aimed at two groups of eye muscle. Rectus muscle of the eye, which is straight muscles, and sidelong muscle, which is oblique. There are four straight and two oblique muscles in the human eye. Straight muscles are located on the right, left, below and above the eyeball. These muscles are responsible for turning the eye, keeping them in the correct position and also giving them the correct shape, similar to a spherical one. With this shape, the image focuses directly on the retina, so a person can see well at any distance. The oblique muscles of the eye, which are responsible for contracting it and giving it an oval shape, are located above and below the eyeball. When it has an oval shape, a person can see well up close. Thus, the visual system works like a camera lens. In myopic people, the oblique muscles work constantly, almost never relax. They are always in tensions. Because of this, the eyes are slightly elongated and bulging forward. Light beams are focused in front of the retina, which makes it possible to perceive the environment well only up close. To see better, the oblique, which is sidelong muscles, must be relaxed. In contrast, in people with farsightedness, the rectus muscle of the eyes are tense and the obliques are relaxed. With this muscle function, the eyes have a more spherical shape, but with a shorter anteroposterior axis than it should be under normal conditions. Because of this, the picture is formed not on the retina, but behind it. This allows you to see well into the distance, but limits the person when considering objects located close to him. In this regard, various sets of exercise are prescribed for this or that ophthalmic pathology. With myopia, the exercise is aimed at relaxing the oblique muscles. An ordinary person without medical education doesn't know these nuances and can choose a set of exercises that don't suit him and are given and contraindicated. What are the benefits of eye muscle relaxation exercises for myopia? Gymnastics is especially useful for the eyes in childhood when they are asked to teach many lessons at school, as well as to the people whose work is associated with a lot on the organs of vision. It is also used for preventive purposes, depending on the type of exercise, gymnastics helps to relax certain muscle groups. In general, any exercise for the eyes with myopia gives the following positive effects. Help to relax the eyes, relieve tensions from them, elimination of symptoms of asthenopia and nervous spasms, prevention of symptoms of dry eye syndrome by stimulating the work of the lacrimal glands. Improving visual acuity, improving focusing, normalization of blood circulation in the eye and provision of the tissue of the eyeball with oxygen and other nutrients stop the progression of myopia. Most importantly, eye gymnastics helps to stop development of myopia. 
exercises to relax the muscle of the eyes with myopia. There are standard exercises that are suitable for all patients, including children. There are also special techniques developed by ophthalmologist scientists. They are aimed at relaxing the eye muscles, improving blood circulation and other effects. If you look in the internet, there are a lot of these exercises and there are a lot of different recommendations for them. People want to improve their vision, they start looking and find it difficult to choose something. Since they don't have criteria for which exercise to choose and which exercise is right for them. Which exercise is better to do and which one should not do at all. That what we will talk about now in this video. We will consider a universal set of exercises that need to be performed and cannot harm. Vision problems in people can be different, but all of these problems have something in common. They are caused by this or that stress. This is mental stress or physical stress, fatigue, and this eye strain and these habits of the eyes to look incorrectly, which were formed against the background of these stresses or some kind of permanent stress, such as working at a computer, with a phone, with tablet, some kind of weight lifting or something else. In any case, the basis is tension and you will get exercises to do and at least start any exercises with them. The exercises in this video are relaxation exercises. And the first exercise is blinking, the most harmless, the simplest and one of the most important exercises. Blinking is an exercise that changes the eye from one mode to another. For example, you want to look from near to far and again from near to far or from dark to light. And in order to do this, the eye must blink and then the visual system is switched. For example, you looked at the computer and then turned your eyes into the distance and there everything is muddy and you cannot see anything clearly. Why you can see anything? It's because you have lost the habit of blinking and not just blinking, but blinking so that you can switch your vision from one mode to another. And therefore, the first exercise is to blink and as often and most importantly, do it correctly. How to blink softly and correctly? Bring your fingers to the weights on your head and blink. And if some muscle or veins move under your fingers at the same time, then you are blinking incorrectly. Relax your eyelids and blink so that no muscle in your eyelids move. The easiest way to learn to blink is look one way and blink, look the other way and blink. And you also need to set your brain so that after each blink you see better. Blink, relax and you see clearly. And now we will talk about the second exercise. Any eye disease is tension. Tension is fatigue and this tension must be removed. The second exercise is to simply close your eyes for 10 seconds and rest. Modern person has forgotten how to do this because vision is constantly mobilized by a computer or phone or tablet. For example, if he plays a game on a computer and his eyes are in constant tension, or a person works at a computer and cannot afford to close his eyes and relax for 10 seconds, as he will immediately get questions and the person must constantly be mobilized and this is a requirement of our society. You need to ignore this requirement a little and teach yourself to close your eyes and relax at least every 15, 20, 30 minutes. 
and thereby relieve stress from your eyes and rest. At the same time, teach yourself to feel relaxation. Close your eyes and plunge into the atmosphere of relaxation and recreation. A very simple exercise to which you need to accustom yourself and it is much more important than twisting strained eyes along a different path. The third exercise is the covering of the eyes for a longer duration in which your palms are also used which is called palming. When palming you give extra warmth and darkness to your eyes and your eyes relax even more. The fourth exercise is solarization, filling the eyes with the sunlight. It helps the eyes and provides essential vitamins. Without the sun, no biochemistry of the eyes occurs. It's like a plants don't grow without sunlight. The fifth and one of the most important exercises is looking to the near objects and then looking far. This is an exercise for accommodation and we must don't forget to blink and then our vision will switch. If for example you are working at the computer, then this mechanism is already very weak. The eyes must be trained to switch. For example, to stand near the window, looked into the distance and then at some part of the window again. And the bonus exercise is the neck warm up. You should do it very gently to establish blood circulation through the neck and the main pathways that are on the neck, as well as supply oxygen. I hope these exercises will help you to improve your vision and hopefully we'll see you again.